What's going on guys, it is Dark Alt, and this is some MTOL 21 gameplay on Cargo. I get two Dragon Files in this match, it's freaking amazing. So, uh, some Black Ops 2, let's just talk about it. I think it's going good, you know, I feel like they really, really did a good job with it. Now, you know, this is not the honeymoon phase, I really think that this will be able to still pass, you know, two months of tons of people playing and still be good. Because if we know... Uh, if a game hits two months and it's still fun and there's nothing unbalanced, it's really good. I mean, the last game that really did that was probably Modern Warfare 2 because the noob tubes came in like January after Wings of Redemption made that video. So, that's when that got bad. But if you look at Black Ops, Ghost was a problem ever since, you know, launch. Uh, Modern Warfare 3 had Assassin, EMP, Stealth Bomber glitches all the time. So, we'll just have to see how this pans out. Hopefully, let's keep our fingers crossed. It's good at least another two months, so we do save all invents investment in the game and actually have fun with it. So, so far, what I'm liking about this game is that all the guns are basically overpowered, meaning there's so much weapon variety. Because when you have one gun that's insanely good and one gun that insanely sucks, you're going to use a gun that, that's good. But when all the guns are like the same, you're forced to use more different guns because you get tired of the same gun. And they all perform equally the same. Now, what what this can cause, though, is that with all this weapon variety, some guns just might not be fun, and you might lose interest in using different guns if they all play the same. Because why use a different gun when you use one gun that's obviously good for you? So that's kind of bad, but it's better for the, the, all the guns to be overpowered than all the guns to suck, right? Uh, I wish they would add some guns that were kind of bad. I mean, all the submachine guns are good. I believe the MP7 is a really fun gun to use. It has a little bit of recoil, if, um, a little bit above medium range, but if you keep it in low to medium range, you do really good. Um, speaking of the LMG, actually, because I just picked it up, the LMGs are phenomenal. They really are. They, they basically, what it is, is a high clip or high round assault rifle with slow movement speed low recoil that's what it is that's what the LMG is and it's really good for domination and stuff but a assault rifle can just outmatch it in most all situations uh, the only advantage you really get from the LMG is not having to reload all the time but when you do have to reload it is kind of a long reload because there was no sleight of hand so, my best bet is to use the LMG in Ground War. Uh, in 66 game modes, you just won't get the most out of it. It'll be one of more, one of those guns that are like, oh, let me just use it to, you know, impress my friends or something. It won't be like, oh, let me use this gun because it's insanely awesome. I mean, that's how that goes. And I just got the Dragon File. And what I can tell you about the Dragon File is you want to be close or down. Uh... The closer you are, the more damage you do, and the more chance of the bullets actually landing on target. Um, as you see, I, I am kind of high up, but you'll see in the next Dragon Throne that I do get later on in this match, I actually do go down low and I get more kills. Uh, I do not recommend the Dragon Throne on this map, just for the fact that uh, there's a lot of, you know, camping spots, buildings to camp in, but maybe like Cargo? Well, not Cargo, I'm sorry, Turbine. That would be a good map for it. The downside of the Dragon Fire, though, is that it can be shot down pretty easily. It takes one single rocket, and then it's basically dead. Uh, so I just suggest skipping out on the Dragon Fire and using the um, Lightning Strike, Ill Strike. That is really badass, actually. You do get a lot of kills with it. As you can see in my Demolition How to Rank Up Fast uh, commentary, it's insanely awesome, actually. So, with that said, uh, there's really nothing else I can tell you guys about the Dragon Fire. I mean, try it out, it's a pretty fun kill streak. But, like I said, I'll always stand by it for, for the most part. The uh, Lightning Strike, Hillstorm, and UAV, I think that's the setup, is simply amazing. It just is. You get so many kills with it that, I want, watch this. This kid gets owned. Get on, bitch, and get my little dragon file. But that that's what I have to say about those three kills. Because I, I want to keep talking about it, boy, you guys, to death. I mean, I already talked about it in a previous video. 
which will probably be linked down below or in the annotation somewhere. So the gameplay is finding now. I get some couple nice kills. I almost tried killing my teammate, I believe. And I'll see you guys on the flip side. Have a good day and enjoy the Dragonfire gameplay.